In this video I would like to show you how you can install and use Five Loop for the Chrome browser. So what you need to do is open the Chrome browser and then go to the Chrome web store. The, the address is chrome.google.com slash web store or just um, search on Google for Chrome web store. And in the Chrome web store you search for Five Loop. Then you see Five Loop right here. And then you press Add here on the top right and say yes, add this extension to my browser. It says that it has been added. And um, now we see um, on the right side of the, of the um, URL search bar this little extension button and we can press it and use this little pin here. So we have um, the five loop icon here fixed. All right, now let's go to the video platform that you like to use and refresh the page. Once you um, refresh the page, um, you can see this little five loop icon on the bottom left and uh, you have to press it in order to show the menu and you can also hide it again by pressing it again. So Five Loop gives you, gives you um, some extra controls that you do not have um, on a regular video player. Um, let me show you. This is basically um, start stop play pause, um, rewind, forward, um, adjust the speed uh, in 5% steps and uh, you can set loops. And how the loop works is basically like a looper pedal. So you press it once um, where you'd like the loop to start and press it a second time at the point you like to end the loop and then it repeats this part of the video. And you if you press it a third time, the loop is cleared and the video plays again. So let me demonstrate. So the lesson I want you to focus on is yeah, that's gonna help. So I'm gonna show you an example of what I'm talking about. I ain't because that now because <laughs> so we'll do something in the key of B flat. So now we, we set a loop and the video keeps repeating and I can adjust the speed. Um, and one thing to mention is um, the Chrome browser has a bug that um, if the speed is 95% the pitch is also changed. All the other steps um, the pitch stays the same. Yep, and here on the right you have a little metronome that you can either tap to change the BPM or you can use the buttons to adjust it and you can turn it on and off right here. <laughs> 